What's up everybody, Ben the Realtor AZ here. Thank you so much for tuning into my channel today. And you gotta join me as we try out a Chicago favorite located here in Scottsdale, Arizona for some good Italian beef sandwiches at Portillo's Hot Dogs, Beef, Burgers, and Salads. It's so good, man, you gotta stay tuned. Welcome back to my channel everyone smash up that like button hit the subscribe button and definitely hit that notification bell so you get notified every time I drop a new video. Okay so we're located in Scottsdale Arizona at Portillo's Hot Dogs Beef Burgers and Salads. Okay this is look at how packed it is first <laughs> first off look at how packed Portillo's is. Okay now this is a Chicago Illinois and just an Illinois Midwestern favorite, okay? Portillo started, I think, back in the 60s out in Chicago. And if you know anything about Chicago food, which is one of my favorite places for food in the entire United States is Chicago. I spent some time out there. I have another video that is in the description. It's up top above. You can uh, check it out. I talk much more about it. We have a heavy population of people from Chicago. Now, what they love in Chicago is the Italian beef, the deep dish pizzas, the pizza pies, and Chicago style hot dogs. Okay, now the Italian beef sandwich is my favorite sandwich by far out of all the sandwiches. And Portillo's is usually a Chicago favorite. If you ever go to Chicago, the first thing people tell you is go to Portillo's and get yourself a sandwich. That's the number one thing you want to do. Okay, and I did just that as well. And I, I frequent here in Arizona. They have another location in Tempe. This location opened up in 2013 and then the Tempe one opened short after. Now go check out the other video on my channel, Luke's Italian Beef in Tucson. Now that place, okay, <laughs> I'll judge. I'm going to give you guys what I think between Luke's Italian Beef and Portillo's. What is my favorite? Okay, I'm going to go ahead and judge that for you guys. Now, like I said, this place in Scottsdale opened in 2013. It's always packed. It's full of Midwesterners. You're going to meet a lot of people from Chicago that you get to speak to and hear their stories. And what I love about people from Chicago is that we have a heavy Chicago presence here. We have the Cubs that have spring training here. We have the White Sox that have spring training at Camelback Ranch and also here in Mesa. So uh, check out that video as well. I'll put that in the description. I went to Camelback Ranch as well to check out the White Sox and the Dodgers. But what I love about Chicago and when you come here to Portillo's is they represent where they're from. They have a lot of pride, a lot of Chicago pride. They represent their teams, win, lose, or draw, no matter what. If you're from the South Side, you rep the Sox. You're from the North Side, you rep the Chicago Cubs. Uh, formerly Comiskey Field, right, on the South Side. And then you have Wrigley Field up on the North Side. And Wrigley has done a lot of business. Even in California, we have an area in Long Beach, California called the Wrigley area, right? We have the Wrigley Mansion here in um, Phoenix, Arizona, right? Wrigley was huge, Wrigley's gum, right? So uh, Chicago is well represented in the Midwest. You got a lot of people who move here for the weather. And uh, this is one of their favorite spots here because it reminds them of home. It reminds them of Chicago. And Chicago is plastered everywhere. You've got the oldies music. Sorry, I couldn't let the, let the music play and let you guys hear the sounds because I'll get hit with a copyright strike. So I have to kind of drown out the music from inside the store but what you see here is a nice old school diner type feel you order your food you go pick it up they also have amazing dessert now if you're ever at portillo's you got to try the the cake shake you got to try the chocolate cake right you have to try the strawberry shortcake as well and if you like hot dogs and burgers and sandwiches you got to try those listen to the sounds a little bit All right, that's just a little bit of the sounds with no music. All right, you got the crinkly fries. Kind of reminds me of Del Taco on the West Coast. I love the crinkly fries from Del Taco. Um, and that's the Italian beef. I cannot wait to unwrap that. That is just 
so good right <clears throat> now what i get is the i get the big one right with the italian sausage it's called the big beef combo okay now the big beef combo you got a, i love the the hot peppers the sweet peppers and it has to be dipped in the juice okay if you guys watch my luke's italian beef i talk about it a little more there as well but it has to be dipped in the juice okay it's 50 percent uh bigger than their regular combo sandwich okay it's a char grilled italian sausage with with italian beef all right and it is delicious guys the flavors just explode in your mouth some people like it with cheese i don't put no cheese on it i want it chicago style just like that don't mess with it right it's just like people who put ketchup on a hot dog never right <laughs> never put ketchup on a hot dog but this is the way i like my italian beef there's a sausage in there okay destroyed it All right, you guys, I absolutely devoured that sandwich. So delicious. But Luke's Italian beef is still number one for me. The bread, the beef, the dip is just second to none. All right, you guys, you can't leave Portillo's without having the chocolate cake slice or the chocolate cake shake. Absolutely delicious. I can't eat this all by myself. So this is what my kids come for as well. They want the sweets, right? Kids are four and five years old. We all share it because it's just too much, right? We, we all devour the cake shakes. We usually get two and split it between the four of us. Or we'll get one and me and my wife will share it, right? absolutely delicious but you guys I, I my choice is luke's italian beef when it comes to the italian beef sandwich i think that it's second to none and uh portillo's gets my number two choice but anyways guys thank you for watching the video like it if you like it share it if you love it i'm out i'll see you on the next one